Baby, Usher don't owe me a dime, okay? Hello, hello. It's your girl, CG on Trina, and I'm back today with a new video. If you're new to my channel in good old Texas fashion, hey, y'all. And if you've been here before, welcome back. Next time, bring a friend. So, y'all know from a couple of videos ago, I told y'all I was going to bring y'all my travel vlog so this vlog um we're gonna step back into the month of july when i went to go see usher baby um honey let me tell y'all something this trip was so fly by the night last minute spur of the moment type stuff um it was the most spontaneous thing that i have ever done i will say that because so um let me just give you a little backstory before we get into the vlog and me voice over and um all of the content but um they came in the house one day after work and said hey uh the gang going to see usher and i'm like in vegas usher and he was like oh yeah and i was just like hmm i was like we going because you know i didn't i didn't know um at this point i didn't know so he was like do you want to go and i was like who gonna say no to go to usher um but anyway, but then I started thinking, I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Um, I already have a, tra a booked uh, travel to go to Oregon because my daughter had to run in a track meet before she got hurt. That trip was already booked. We had already booked our cruise for September and we wanted to do something for my birthday in August. So I'm thinking like, did we just turn in the uh, Bill and Hillary Clinton or did we run into some money that I don't know about? but where there's a will there's a way and um if it was meant to be it was meant to be and that's kind of what i told him and <clears throat> it happened we booked flights um he bought the tickets um with his friends of course and um, we booked the flights and we got a hotel so guys we stayed at uh planet hollywood um which was very nice i've never stayed at planet hollywood in vegas before and we flew spirit Cause like I said, this was last minute. We was trying to get the more, you know, the more bang for our buck. Cause baby, it was like, uh, oh, we about to rob Peter and pay Paul. I didn't want to do that. So we worked it out. It all worked out and we were able to go. And I was like, well, you know what? This could be an early birthday gift. Cause you know, I'm thinking, you know, I don't, I don't really have any solid plans for my birthday in August, but this could be an early birthday gift because this, baby, when I tell you them tickets was up here. Mm-hmm. They was up here. Um, and they gone up now even more, um, I think. So we paid. And I don't tell you how much we paid. Because, I, I mean, it's over now. But um, we paid um, $650 per person for the tickets. And we set up pretty high. But I will say, in the, in the venue, there is no bad seat. Like, you can sit way in the nosebleed section. Like, we wasn't way up there. We was, you know down a bit but you could sit waiting in those weeks and still see the entire show and capture every moment so baby usher don't owe me a dime okay because when i tell you this show was the bomb it was the bomb now i know everybody done been to the beyonce concert i'm not really a beehive person or fan or whatever she got some good songs she's a very good entertainer but that's just not my job you know, I'm a 90s girl. I come from the 90s. So 90s R&B is always going to win with me in the, no matter what. So honey, when I tell you Usher did his thing, he did his thing. The show started about nine, but usually that, that was the DJ getting everybody pumped up, crunked up. And then, I mean, after that, it was just nonstop, just nonstop. The, the catalog just goes and goes and goes. So it was a really, really good, good, good show. And I'm going to voice over the footage when i put it on you know when i bring the footage on i'm just gonna do a voiceover just kind of tell you what we had going on what we did while we were in vegas it was just a weekend trip turnaround trip but i do hope you enjoy it and if you can get a chance my recommendation is that you go see usher baby don't wait till the super bowl <laughs> go see usher baby because it's a good show it's a really really good show i mean he really did his thing and gave you your money's worth so <sighs> my advice so let's get to the footage. So here we are in the airport, just taking a toast before we board our flight. The what you say? Mm -hmm. First class, baby. First class, baby. Okay. First class, baby. Okay. <laughs> 
Y'all, we are so goofy. That's what you get when you get two Virgos. We, you put them together, just goofiness all day. But as y'all can see, we got first class on spirit. <laughs> Checked into her hotel. And as you can see, Candy, hello, welcome to Planning Hollywood. All we did was kind of walk around the hotel, get a little acclimated with it. So let me show you what our room looks like. Very simple. We got a little couch over there. We got a bed. I got a little table if you want to eat a little something. Bathroom was really nice. We have this little tub situation, a private um, toilet area, and then the shower. We went up to a friend's room and took the view from their room because our view was just a bunch of walls. And then we walk through the mall because the mall is located next to Planet Hollywood. And then we just kind of walked through the mall and he had to be goofy and go look up the girl's dress. This is what I wore to Usher. This dress is from Shein. The shoes are from like a local boutique. And I have my little love truck on. And I'm just dancing. Baby, this is the DJ girl. He was giving all the vibes. The DJ was very good. Very nice intro to the show. And I can say we had a really good time. And we got there late. Y'all, us's entrance was thebomb.com. As you can see, he's coming on the stage. And like I said, this is the actual angle from my camera as to where we were sitting. And the seats were really good. We were just like a level above the floor. So it was really good seating. Really, really good. And y'all, he did his thing. The dancing was amazing. The light show was amazing. I mean, it was all good. I'm giving you photos from the videos that were on the screen and then also a little bit of dancing here and there because baby Usher was jamming, okay? I don't even know. I don't remember what song this was, but because, you know, I don't want to get copyrighted, but y'all, it was so good, and I love me some Usher. Then he switched clothes, and he went to the ATL, shouty, uh, and have his Atlanta Braves jersey on, and it was just all good. Y'all, look how cute. Yeah, I remember Usher when he was like, when he first came out, girl, he did all those songs too as well. And of course, the infamous roller skating, um, he did that and that was very good. All of the dancers on his show was just like very good. I wish I could, I was just wishing that I could be one of the dancers on the show, but I mean, Usher called me. Call me if you want me to, you know, dance or roller skate in any of your uh concert because i'm ready baby i'm ready i got my skates we ready but yeah he just skated around the floor and then they did a little break i think at this particular moment usher went to go change clothes and so the dancers just got on stage and then he came back with this little lime green ensemble um you can't really tell what the colors are from where I, from the the picture that i inserted but it was all good the end of the night he did a cute little light show and here's the gang, y'all. We had a really good time. So the next day, me and Bay decided to get a cabana and we ordered some Gordon Ramsay. And then we went, you know, we just sat at the pool all day. As you can see, plenty of Hollywood, Vegas. We kind of just sat at the pool for the um for the day. It was really, really hot out there, y'all. And then as y'all can see, we about to uh we got in the water like towards the end, like right when it was like 30 minutes before the pool closed. We got in the water, but we just kind of wanted to just chill and have all the vibes. This bathing suit was so cute. It's from Shein as well. I got it about like two or three years ago. The drinks were flowing. They were good as well. And of course, I had to do my infamous model pose. Later that night, we stepped outside and went to a couple of the, co we went to the Cosmopolitan, um, to the bar over there. And then we kind of just walked around Vegas a little bit, just, you know, enjoying the sights we went over to the link and then we got on the ferris wheel and we were able to see the sphere um that now it wasn't open then but it is open now so right here we were in the link we were on the you see the little ferris with a little ball that is located at the link hotel so we did that really cute it was about like a 30 minute ride all the way around so you could see vegas really really good as you can see here's our elevation and you know, it tells you, you know, how far you up high. But here we are the next Sunday, and we're getting ready to go. We just went for a little brunch at the Bellagio. Back at the airport, ready to go. Bay looks sad. Bye, Vegas. I hope you guys enjoyed my trip to Vegas, um, because I did. Um, But I hope you enjoyed just a little snippet that you got of me enjoying myself in the city of Las Vegas. 
like I said, if you get a chance to go and see the show, please go and see the show. Make it a, a, a bucket list item. I mean, whatever you got to do to get to Vegas. Save a few coins here and there. I feel like it is very, 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 very worth it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. And I will see you guys in the next one.